on this today, but everybody should know that AI is not brewing beer. Um, it's important. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Okay. Please, please. Okay, cool. So what I'm actually going to present on, honestly, I think is a little bit cooler. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. It's kind of crazy. I mean, look at the title of this. Cyborg Stingray. Yes. Okay. Oh, <laughs> We're going to watch a quick video. Um, and it's posted on Slack for remote people. Oh no, <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at this. <laughs> okay, but so, so basically, what some genetic engineers did is they took, so the outline is gold filament, and they covered it in a layer of silicon, like what's in uh, breast implants, and they put a layer of rat heart cells, muscle oh. cells underneath okay. it, and they built like a living, moving robot. Um, it, yeah, I know, it's freaking crazy, right? Oh no, okay. So um, the way it moves is that it responds to light stimulus. So the guy was like flashing light and they're able to like guide it through obstacle courses. And this thing like survived for, I think a week or something like that. And it moves around in like, um, kind of a matrix of like sugars and stuff that the cells need to survive. Um, also, that's eat. Does it what? Eat. Not in the traditional sense, but like the, the um, fluid that it moves through is absorbed by the cells and they like metabolize it, which is not so good. And what does that mean it survives? Like what's, what you, what's your definition of life? So right, I mean, so they're calling it alive, but not, um, I, yeah, Organic? maybe. I don't remember. Um, but so, like, it, like, would move for, like, a week, and then I guess it died. Like, the cells died. Because um, they don't have a way to regenerate, as far as I can tell. Um, but so, like, this is super cool. What on earth could the implications be for <laughs> a cyborg stingray? <laughs> um, so there are a couple articles that I read, and one said that, um, like, for the future of like deep sea exploration, <laughs> we could build these kinds of robots. Um, but the other article um, was talking about the actual intentions of the biologists, and what they hope to do is build like fully functional, like semi-robotic hearts and replacement organs for people. So like, you're, if you like need to have a heart transplant or something, like it will essentially never fail. And this is kind of the first step in that direction like producing something that can survive and then producing something that can like keep like regenerate itself kind of I think is the next step. Um, I don't know why they chose to make a stingray first but you know <laughs> it's crazy. Um, I don't know if anybody has any thoughts or questions I can sort of attempt to answer but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah like it's crazy. Yeah. This was just announced yesterday. So it doesn't keep growing? No, it doesn't grow. Um, not they, right, not yet. Because <laughs> I think it's limited by like the, the exoskeleton of like gold filament, basically. Just wants gold. Yeah. What? 